mode already. It seems like, you know, maybe they should just make it a four day work week, but yeah. I'm not suggesting that, <laughs> but it is, you know, perhaps an idea that I've heard some people say. Mm -hmm. It's April Fool's Day too. They could have done something. Oh yeah, I mean. <laughs> April I, Fool's Day home, no. <laughs> yeah, uh, boss, I'm going to work. <laughs> oh, April Fool's, no, I'm yeah. staying home and sleeping. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, uh, we need to be here because we need to give you the weather forecast for this weekend, and it's a good weekend for Forecast. We got rain chances tonight and as we head into early tomorrow morning, but right now clear skies temperatures are in the 30s and 40s, so it is a chilly start, so you do need those jackets. That is no April Fool's joke there. High pressure moving off to the east that will allow our next storm system and cold front to move in. And as we look at future cast, not a lot happening through noontime. Clouds stay off to the west, but slowly but surely we'll start to see more clouds by five o'clock this evening. And here come the rain chances. Now look how non widespread this is. No need to cancel those plans tonight or tomorrow morning if you got them because this is what we're looking at on radar at midnight showers by early tomorrow morning, five, six o'clock in the morning. That's probably going to be your best bet at seeing the rain. We might see a little bit of drizzle, some light rain, but cold front's going to move through and that will be drying us out. So some good news there. Otherwise, for the bus stop forecast today, great day for recess for the kids, maybe even the adults if they want to go out and play on the playground. We'll be in the 60s and 70s through noon and three o'clock. Next storm system. This is valid Monday into Tuesday. Notice the time here. This is Monday afternoon storm system out to our west. We are in the warm sector with plenty of Gulf moisture and warm temperature temperatures. That's where we see those showers and thunderstorms. Some of these storms here could be strong to severe, so we'll keep an eye on that. But as we roll into your Tuesday, rain chances will slowly come to an end early Tuesday morning and the front will eventually move through our region. Now, now looking beyond that six to 10 days out, once we get that rain out, the temperatures are going to take a tumble and I expect those highs to be in the 60s and 70s and then a drier weather pattern is expected. So if you have those plans for the middle, the late part of next week, go ahead and keep them because it doesn't look like we're going to have a major storm system. In the meantime, as I mentioned tonight, tomorrow, slight chance of rain. Better storm chances Monday into Tuesday, 76 Wednesday. We're at 68 on Thursday. Deep East Texas, same trend. We've got 280s in the forecast Sunday and with Monday storms, but we do cool down starting next Thursday. For the latest weather forecast, you can head on over to KETK.